Thank you, Mike. The mobile underway. Bonnie's chance, the red-hot favourite for the mile as they get round to the starting barrier. Racing now in the field away in the Pan Am mile and quiet win second favourite out fairly well but oh Bonnie's chance she's quickly sped to the lead over in the outside and she's put two lengths on the field already from quiet win and Dundas out wider to Almana going up to join them Diamond moves three deep along the rail is followed by the Sting in behind Adele Regal and Amaze and Norton has settled down last there's plenty of pace on early as they come through now the straight the first time and Bonnie's chance she's made the lead going through the first quarter and just on 29 and a half seconds and uh, she's out by two and a half lengths from quiet win Almana's left without cover over on the outside Diamond Moose is three deep in the inner being joined over on the outside by the chestnut Dundas El Regal and the Stinger next they were followed by a maze and two lengths away last as they travel into the back is Norton the Pan Am mile field now led by last year's winner passing the 900 pole Bonnie's chance and she puts on the P speed out by two and a half lengths from quiet win as she goes down down to the half and through the half and just on a minute and point five of a second by two lengths she leads quiet win Almana ahead away the outside Dundas running fourth just ahead in front of the big horse Diamond Moose along the rail and here's the Sting moving up three wide El Regal was next followed by Amaze being urged along wider out and Norton wide and behind them only six lengths covering them all off the back they come with 500 to run and Bonnie's chance out by two and a half lengths the leader going for the double from quiet win and Almana together the sting three wide and Dundas piercing through between them and Diamond Moose along the rail followed by Amaze El Regal and Norton round of the home turn they come now and with 2.20 left to run and Pat O'Reilly he releases the brakes and she's torn away by four lengths from quiet win under pressure Almana's running on well and so is Dundas and the big horse Diamond Moose trying to get through nearer the rail but there's only one in the pan and Mile is down to the line she comes and Bonnie's chance she goes to the line and she wins it nicely by about three and a half lengths, second home Dundas quiet win third, they were followed home by Diamond Moose, Almana, Norton El Regal, the Sting and last in would have been a maze unofficially about 1.58 Well you've just seen history made at Addington Raceway in the 11 years the Pan Am Miles been run, no horse has ever won it twice and Bonnie's chance has just done it so handsomely the others really weren't in the same class, once Pat O'Reilly scurried it to the front as they left the home turn for the first time, it really was all over, and it was just to work out for this very, very good mare, obviously right back to her best. Let's have a look at them as they turn for home, and there's Bonnie's chance in shot at the moment, and she's got a good three lengths on Quiet Wind, who's battling on well on the fence there. Diamond Moose, the big horse, has snookered on the rails at the moment, because our man is keeping him in there, and the horse coming down the outside is number three Dundas who went a particularly good race as well but Patrick O'Reilly just sitting quiet as a mouse on this lovely mare as she comes down towards the winning post and she certainly got the field well and truly in hand as she comes down to the shadow of the winning post Patrick O'Reilly just sitting there lets the mare do the job all by herself and the gap is ever widening as she gets down to the winning post She's won it very well indeed in around about 158 Dundas the big chestnut ran on very well to take second it looks as if number two quiet win on the fence there would take third and Diamond Moose the big horse didn't ever get a shot at the leaders at any part of it and he's run on well for fourth and uh, Almana would perhaps be the best of the others but no doubt about the winner number five Bonnie's chance that's her 28th win and the winning stake tonight will take her stake earnings now to something over three hundred and ten thousand dollars and she's been a marvelous money spinner for her two lady owners, Mrs. McGarry and Mrs. Uh, Grice, 